around the world. Hey guys! Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Sofia Luna and for today's video, I'll be showing you guys my note-taking essentials because I'm the type of student who likes to decorate and design her notes. But before we get started, I would like to give a shout out to Dana. Thank you for supporting me and watching my videos. And without further ado, let's get started. Um, video or the notebooks and the first notebook um, I'll be showing you guys is this one this is from Japan um, specifically Daiso Japan I know we live in the Philippines I'll try to find um, similar ones from Shopee and Lazada and I'll try to link it down below but um, this is just like a notebook and it has dividers I really like this notebook because it's really smooth and it's really inexpensive and it re it's really nice and as I said, it has dividers and um, there's a lot of colors. There's also yellow but I already finished that notebook so I threw it away. So yeah. The next notebook I'll be showing you guys is this one. It's very thin. I really like it and the paper is really smooth. And it comes with four different colors, pink, blue, orange, and purple. Although I got this from Japan, I think, or the US, so we really, we really don't have it in the Philippines. But I have good dupes for this one, which um, it's the, no the Muji Notebooks. And it's quite expensive, but it's really worth it because the paper is really smooth as well and it's easy to write on. And um, this is just the plain ones, and there's grid, line, dotted. I really like these notebooks. It's quite expensive, but it's gonna be worth it. The last notebook I'll be showing you guys or buying there is this one. This is from Muji again, and I haven't really used this because our school provides us our own notebooks. And yeah, I didn't really use this yet, but the paper is really smooth as well. All notebooks or everything from Muji is really uh, minimalist, but it's like worth it for the price. And yeah, and this is just a binder. This is in the size A5. To decorate my notes, I also have stickers. I always use stickers and I just got these from Shopee. I'll try to link um, the shop down below. And it's very cute. I also use washi tapes and these are just some of my favorites. One thing I always use are post-it notes. It's very helpful and yeah, I have um, the color of the pastel ones. I got this from Target. Although I think Meriden's a Shopee. I'll try to find and link it down below as well. The other post-it notes, I got it from Canada. Um, yeah, it's very cute. My favorite correction tape is this one. It's also from Japan. Well, we have this in National Bookstore. This is the plus one and it's quite expensive, but I really like it. But if you're in the um, tipid side, I recommend the rewrite correction tape. It's very small and it can fit in your pencil cases. So I always use rulers as well so that the lines aren't um, curved and it's straight so it looks better. So we're on to the last part of this video which are the pens and markers and the first thing I'll be showing you guys is this one. It's the Crayola Super Tips and it looks like that. I got this from Amazon but I think, I believe, we have it here in the Philippines as well. It's just quite pricier. So it's this one. I really like it for um, calligraphy um, because I don't really have the Tombow ones. It's expensive so I don't have them. So this is really a good dupe for those, so I really recommend this. The next thing I recommend is this Pentel Food... Feud? Food? I don't know, it's just the um, Pentel Sign Pen something. It's a brush marker and I really like it, it doesn't um, leak through the pages. So. I also always use this Friction Pilot Friction Pen and it has four colors, black, blue, pink, and purple. And 
my super 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 favorite highlighters are the um, Zebra Mide Liners. I really love these. I have, I think, not really all the colors, but I have a lot. And if you're gonna buy a highlighter, I recommend these. It's quite expensive. It's around 80 pesos each. Um, it's because it's really long lasting. It's really nice and it's a dual tip. So, yeah. Along with that, I also got the brush markers of that kind, the Zebra Mide Liners. Um, brush markers. I got this from Shopee. I'll link it down below. So we're on to the note-taking part of this video and I really like this Pilot um, Juice Pen in 0.7. I've been using this since I'm, I was grade 7. So there's different colors but um, I really like the black ones for like note-taking itself. So another brush marker. Um, I really like these Crayola brush marker. Um, I think we don't have it in the Philippines yet. I'm not really sure. I got this from the US again and I really like it. Um, again, I don't have the Tombow so I use these and it's quite good. It's like the same. I'm not sure but this is really good and it's much affordable. I also have this um, zebra um, brush marker. I got from Shopee as well and this Muji mechanical pencil. And lastly, my favorite pens are these Muji um, clickable pens, retractable in 0.5. I have a lot of colors and I just really like it. It's very smooth and yeah, I just love it so much and it's the best ones for me. So so I think that is it for this video. I hope you guys liked it and enjoyed this video. I might do a desk tour, a um, note-taking video very soon. So um, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe to my channel now and turn on that post notification bell to be notified whenever I post a new video, which is once a week. So I think that's it and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!